Welcome. This is an introduction to the future workshop series. There are four workshops in this. Um, this introduction will be in front of all four of them and be exactly the same. But the four workshops that we're calling the future series came about because Chris and I, Christine Catherine Rush and I, were been talking for a long time um, about where all this is headed. We do all these workshops to help writers figure out things like depth, how to get readers in, um, business, the magic bakery on how to understand, uh, you know, the, the structure of business and all of that. And it occurred to us quite a while back that we had no workshops that really talked about the future. And coming up this week here in Las Vegas, we have the Master Business class, um, and that's where people come in from all over the world, literally. Um, and for five days, we're talking about business, all the ins and outs of business. And there are quite a bit of um, aspects in this one, down in the weeds and in this stuff, about different forms of um, what you can do here, what you can do there. And um, all of it is short term. All of it is, oh, if you do this now, it's going to happen, but this might change. And, oh, you know, I mean, we have Damon from Book Funnel, you know, the, the person who started Book Funnel. He's here this week, um, and he's going to be talking about some of the innovations that are going on. But all these innovations and all of this are very short term. And learning how to tell better stories is a long term thing. But what are you going to do with it? And thus... We finally decided that it was time to do this future series to help writers learn how to think out. Now, this is a long-term career. I know, I know many people don't want to think that way, but this is a long-term career. It does take quite a bit of time to build up. Uh, most people want to write one or two novels and, and be rich, and it, it, it seldom works that way. And if it does that work, work that way, it usually hurts the writer more than it helps them for any long term. Um, early success is often very deadly to any kind of writer career. Um, and so what we have tried to do here is basically try to delineate out in four six-week-long workshops – that's how much there is to cover here. And we actually carved it down from six or seven six-week-long workshops to four workshops in this series. We think we can get it all into six, four workshops at six weeks each. They are, tr they are standard workshops. They will have five assignments that you can do or not do at your choice. Um, each one will take a, a week. And we're going to make it so that you need to have the previous workshop before because these are going to build on each other. By the time you get to number four, which we're calling patience, which is something most writers don't have, um, we are going to actually have built quite a bit. And so what happens in, in the first workshop, which is renew and refresh, um, and the six weeks there, then in the second workshop, which is opportunities, we'll build off of that first workshop and add to quite a bit, and then they will build. So by the time you get through all four of these workshops, you should have a very clear sense from two people here and a lot of over the decades talking with other long-term writers how to gear towards long-term career, long-term success in fiction writing. This is about fiction writing career. Now, Chris and I, I suppose we should tell you a little bit about this. I sold my first short story in 1974, actually my first two short stories, and a whole bunch of poems. Um, but that's when I started selling. It was in 1974. Now, I had a lot of ups and downs between 1974, but I became a full-time writer and have never really looked back in 1988. Um, and so, you know, that is 30 years as a full-time writer and... 40, yeah, 
44 years since I sold my first one. So we, we've been around a long time. We're not going anywhere. We're making really nice living at writing fiction and have for quite a while. Um, I have 23 million copies of my books in print. Uh, Chris has never allowed me to count hers. Uh, she doesn't want to know, I don't think, how many millions of copies of her books are in print. Um, and so we've been doing this a long time. Um, we are successful long-term writers. Um, we're not household names, you know, by any stretch, but we're both New York Times bestsellers and USA Today bestsellers. I like to call myself a USA Today bestseller because it's a better bestseller list. It's not as phony. Um, and so, you know, it's just we've been here. We've done it. We're studiers of the business. We study what happens. We study the ups and downs. And what we're hoping in this series of four workshops will be to help you prepare for the ups and downs. Prepare your career for long-term success and making a lot of money. There's a lot of money to be made in this writing business, enormous amounts of money. And it's great fun. This business is great fun. Sitting alone in a room and making stuff up as your job description is a wonderful, wonderful long-term job description. <laughs> And especially when you can make a lot of money at it, which Chris and I do. There's a lot of ways to help your career long term. So these workshops, these four workshops, which you need to take one, two, three, and four if you're going to go through this series. And we've opened this up. Of course, all of these will be in the, in the lifetime subscriptions for the workshops. So all of the lifetimers can go through these at their own pace. And um, you all can, you can jump in too. We will bundle these four together and, and give you a little bit of a discount to take all four of them. Um, it is the only way that we could figure out on this massive topic of future. How do you prepare for the future? Learn how to be a good writer. Keep learning how to tell stories. Keep learning new business tricks. Keep all of that. But what do you do with it all? That's what this series is all about. Kate, see you in the first video.